What's up everyone, it's your man Will, and I'm in Jersey City Heights at the soft opening of the Riverview Wine Shop. Uh, it's right here in the old Mankey's Delicatessen and Liquor Store. Uh, it's been closed for a lot of years, but now they're opening it up, and today we get our first taste of some wine, and I think there's some cheese involved. So stay tuned, come with me, come join me on my journey. Okay, I'm with Laura, the owner of the Riverview JC Wine Shop, is that correct? Correct, Riverview Wine and Spirits. Wine and Spirits, okay. And you're actually in an old delicatessen, right? You took over? Yeah, I took over. I, um, knew, I know that this place was closed for a long time, mm -hmm. and then uh, one day I just saw the sign that said, like, for rent, and oh. I, I called the landlord. It's, he was, he's a great guy. So, yeah, it worked out. Awesome. Now, what, what makes your wine shop uh, different than other wine shops? Um, up here, uh, there's nothing like it. Okay. It's definitely a boutique um, wine shop. I handpick all the wines. They are wines um, that I personally love and also farmer made. So they are uh, natural, organic, biodynamic, and they're everyday wine. So like, unpretentious, very easy to drink, um, very fun. So it's nothing that you're going to find everywhere else up here. Awesome. Where can someone, besides coming to your physical location, where can people find you online, like your social media? Just for now, just social media. I literally just put some, for some cases over there, so I'm not, I don't have a web page. Yeah. Okay, okay. But what's your, uh, what's your Instagram page? Uh, what? Uh, it's Riverview Wine JC. Okay, did you hear that? Everyone follow, come buy a bottle of wine. I recommend it. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. And, uh, and I'm... So this is Galliopo from Calabria. Yeah. Cool, all right. It's good to see you. I know, right It's been a yeah, while. Likewise, yeah. Yeah. So you guys live right here. Also. Yeah, I'm like two blocks away on Webster. So yeah, it's great, man. That's, that's what I'm saying. Like, it's just nice to have uh, somewhere to go for, for a good bottle of wine. Cause... Hey there, John Tregonis here, and you know, I'm, in, I'm in my neck of the woods, the Heights. And funky as all hell. Honestly, this just tasted like Sorry, I'm, I'm totally trying to be all, you know, but this, like, literally, hold on. Yeah, barbecue. Barbecued food. That's what I'm getting. Oh, all right. John says this is good. Kind of tastes like barbecue. I want to taste barbecue. Oh, like smoky. Real smoky. Has a kind of a Melbeck like zap on your tongue, but then the smoke comes out. Yo, this would be the one I would buy. This is totally, this is like right barbecue. Anything with meat, carnivore. Mm. They don't have many wines right now because they're still doing a soft open, but the wines that I did taste were really good. I suggest you stop by and support them. Until next time, I'm Will, and I'm telling stories through food.